Hi everybody, and I'm Ian from InfoTV, and welcome to the AV department, where we'll be talking about audio video tips, tricks, and products. Today we'll be talking about the Manfrotto 290 Lite tripod with the Live Fluid Be Free Head. For those of you who are already camera savvy, then you would know about Manfrotto's company. Manfrotto is an Italian company that makes some of the best tripods on the market, but also some of the most expensive, being to where a lot of people can't get them for their first tripod. Now recently Manfrotto has released a line of, of cheaper, more budget friendly tripods like these. They are the B Free series, which is their portable, smaller series. Smaller being cheaper, obviously. And so for this one, this is their 290 tripod, which is the smaller size to the legs. There's two sizes, the 290 and then slightly larger, you can get more extended ones, but also obviously more expensive. Now with this head, it is their B Free Live Fluid Motion Head. Now for those of you who don't know what a fluid head is, a fluid head is a tripod head with obviously fluid inside of it. It helps with pans and tilts and is able to control the, the pressure inside of it so that way you get more accurate movements as well as more smoother movements compared to other tripods. As I mentioned before, the one of the most important things on this tripod is the fluid head. The fluid head is amazing for video work as well as just basic photography work due to the ability to tighten or loosen the pan movements, the tilt movements, as well as panning and tilting, to make it easier, you have this extension arm on the side to help you push your camera around rather than holding it onto the camera and causing shaky movements or causing too much shutter. Well, this will create a more smooth transition between shots and movements around the screen. Now, for those of you who work with smaller tripods, you'll notice that the plate story is pretty small on them. This one on the Manfrotto head is a very, very sturdy, very thick plate for its size, for the size of the tripod. It has a quarter inch screw to screw onto your camera, which is standard with most cameras and especially most DSLRs. Now, when you put it in, you just slide it in and tighten the bolt on the side. And if you feel it, it's very sturdy. It stays in there very well compared to some other tripods, which can still jiggle. This one stays right in there, right tight. Other features of this tripod include the ability to extend its head even more high. When in situations where you might not have enough room on the ground for you to extend your tripod, but you need to be a little bit higher. It also helps get that to the maximum height for eye level when you're standing up. As you can see on these legs right here as well, there are these locks on it to help extend the tripod legs farther outwards if you're going for lower shots and you need to be closer to the ground, as well as keeps it nice and sturdy, especially if you're in wider environments where there might be a bit more movement. As someone who works with photo and video, I would highly recommend this tripod to anyone who wants to use it, uh, anyone who wants to stay mobile and light in their video and photography, or someone like students where your budget may not be that big. This tripod is a great all-around tripod that's light, cheap, easy to use, and sturdy. This was Ian with InfoTV, signing off.